Hello and welcome to the channel. In this video, I'll be describing a problem I have and hopefully also presenting a solution. Whoops, camera was twisted. Okay, so the problem I have is that my drone with the ELRS receiver is bound. I have floated before. When I turn on my controller, you will see the thing moving there. Well, let me do that now. That, all of that works, but when I plug the drone in, let's see if I can just one hand. I don't, that's all they get. I don't get the pop pop. But you go say, okay, well, the, the transmitter is not on, so you wouldn't get the two tone. But here with my Cinelog 25, if I could also plug this up with one hand, you would hear that the drone would make the would make five total beeps. The pop pop pop, then the pop pop. Even though my transmitter is off. So let me prove that this is on. Sorry, this is bound to this. Welcome to deviation. All right, and as you see, Stylers are moving, the model is moving. Alright, well, first issue is that my transmitter is dying. 4.71 volts my transmitter is reading right now. This is actually hilarious because the first time I flew the drone, my battery was also dead on the transmitter. So my drone feels safe that it fell out of the sky and I, and I scratched up my carbon fiber. So I'm going to replace the batteries in here and try again. Okay, I replace the batteries from the transmitter with a two cell lipo close that up turn it on all right i am reading 8.21 volts 8.2 volts all right and model still getting response And well, there, there's no green light here. And let's check the back. Yeah, it's just cycling through colors, which is generally a sign that it's not working the way it's supposed to. Plug in the drone. And nothing. You don't get the pop pop. All right, this is part two of the video. So I have opened up the drone and what I did, I pushed these two connections in, um, power to the flight controller from the ESC because I realized that before when I plugged the drone into the LiPo, only the ESC and the motors would go. I would not get the lights from my ELR ELRS receiver, nor would the board light up the receiver and the board would only light up when i plug the drone into the computer via the usb port so i just open it up push this pin push this thing in because i suppose this got dislodged when i crashed a while ago so i push the pin in i push these pins in and let's check it now All right, nice. I get the five beeps, the pom 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 pom. I have lights on my receiver, lights on my board. I even have lights on my VTX, which I did not know, did not realize were not on when I was plugging it up to the computer. 
but then again that makes sense because why would the vtx yeah um you can't you don't have enough power over usb for the vtx to be powered on now to start out the issue on the drone side only one light is on on my uh, jumper radio and this light is cycling through stuff so i don't know if that's good or bad but let me put this up here i'm going to arm the drone um this is this is a very bad idea Arming. Hey, let's go with armed. Disarmed. All right. Well, yeah, that's how to solve the problem of um, your drone is not arming, but you are seeing movements in the in beta flight. Um, I'll figure out a proper name so that you guys can can find this video and learn how to troubleshoot it. All right. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye.